I'd be lying if I said I was fully recovered. But sometimes with pain comes clarity. The New York City Half Marathon is now less than a month away. And as I try and get myself to the start line, I realize that this race for me isn't just about chasing a time. This is about two years of unfinished business. March 12th, 2020. I still remember getting the email three days before we were set to race. Due to the rapidly developing coronavirus situation, the New York City half has been canceled. At the time, I think we all recognized that this wasn't a good situation, but I don't think we realized just how bad things could get so quickly. From cancellations and closures one moment to overwhelming tragedy the next, it all hit like a bomb in New York was at the center of it. You know, the mind has a funny way of processing time because some of that feels so far away, whereas some of it feels like it was just yesterday. But it's actually neither. It's two years, two years to hell and back. Finally, a new day for New York City, along with the New York City half. Our first major road race to be canceled during the pandemic is now the first to return at full capacity with 25,000 runners many of whom, like me, have some unfinished business. So yeah, after what we've all been through, my current training setback doesn't seem like much of a setback at all. 